Let's see how we can install Java JDK 21 in Windows 11 and create a new project and run it. First, go to your browser and go to this URL. Hit enter. I'll have this URL in the description. You can go from there. Scroll down and you will see these options. Now I'm using Windows, so I'll click on Windows. You can use Linux or Mac OS. Click on this installer. Second one. We use this MX64 installer, not the MSI installer. So now our download is complete. Click on open file. This will open the installer. If you see a message that says, I do want to install, just click yes. Our installer is now open, click next. And this is where our Java JDK will be installed. Make sure you remember this path because we might have to use it later in environment variable. So it is inside program files, inside Java, inside JDK 21. Click next and our Java is installing. So once the Java is installed, click close. And now we can check our Java version by using CMD. So let's see what version of Java we have installed. We'll type Java double dash version. And as you can see, it is Java 21. So we have our JDK and runtime environment and everything ready. So let's create a Java project. We can close this by typing exit. I'll just create a project in my desktop. You can create it anywhere you want. Right click and I'll create a new folder. Let's call it my Java project. Now inside this, we will create a new file. Now generally we use editors like Visual Studio Code or uh, Eclipse to create Java projects, but we can just create simple projects using Notepad itself. So I'll use that. If you want to learn how you can run Java from Visual Studio Code, check the link in the description. Now, create a new text document. Let's call it java.city.java. Uh, now we will open this in Notepad itself because it's easier to edit. Or we can use it in any other editor. Now let's write some Java code and let's see how we can run it. So my file is here. Let's create a Java class. And now we will create a public static void main function. Now this function is the entry point of everything in Java. Let's print something. And let's say we want to print hello from Java. And semicolon here, we need that in Java. Okay, now our code is ready. Now I can close this. And we want to now again open our command prompt so that we can run this. So to open that, what you can do is hold shift and right click and click on open PowerShell window here. Or if you see open command prompt here, that is also fine. Or another method is to just go here and type CMD, hit enter. And command prompt will open in this directory. As you can see, we are inside our project folder. Now we need to compile this. So type Java C and then the code. You can just hit tab and it will auto complete. Hit enter and there is error. So we have error in our code. Okay, so let's right click and open it with Notepad again. So I'm used to using Python. So if this is not single, it's double quotes in Java. So save again, go back to the command prompt and let's try to compile this again. Now it has compiled successfully. If I go here, Close this, minimize this, and refresh this. There's a new file called the codecity.class, right? Now, to run this, you just type Java, not C this time, and then the code city. Hit enter, and as you can see, hello from Java is printed. So this is how you can install JDK 21 and create a Java project and run it using Windows or just command line. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.